Hello there everybody. So my name is Julie. I'm lactation consultant. You may know me from the Carmenta Life Breastfeeding Cafe, which I'm afraid is not open at the moment. So I this is the second day of my vlog to help you to well just give you some breastfeeding tips to help you on your journey, which can be quite challenging. Um, and I know there's not much support out there. So today I want to talk about frequency of feeding. How often should your baby feed? Well, breastfeeding and bottle feeding are very different from one another. Human milk and formula milk work in very different ways in the body. So if you're formula feeding your baby, your baby may be able to last for three or four hours before needing another feed. Uh, but because, and that's because the formula sits for a bit longer in the stomach, it's slower to digest. If, however, your baby is particularly colicky, refluxy, sicky, windy, um, is particularly unsettled or um, can't tolerate those big amounts, you may need to give smaller amounts more frequently and you may need to wind your baby a bit more frequently as well. So breast milk, human milk, works very differently in the baby's stomach. It is very quick to digest, which is why a breastfed baby needs to be fed frequently. When a baby's first born, <clears throat> The stomach is really, really small. It's, it, it's, can, it's about the size of a teaspoon, so about seven mils a baby can tolerate to start with. So that's why a baby needs to be fed little and often for the first couple of days. You may find that on the second day, a baby is quite sleepy and there's, that's where that skin to skin comes in very uh, well, which we talked about yesterday. But your baby needs to feed frequently. The human milk actually has a laxative effect, so if you've ever wondered why your babies poos a lot, then it's because the milk has a laxative effect which helps to clear any germs out of the baby's gut. So that's a good thing, your baby should be pooing lots and should be having nice yellow nappies by day four or five and plenty of them so that you know that your baby's having enough milk. So a breastfed baby should feed at least six to eight times in 24 hours. Realistically, this is often a lot more and often 10 to 12 times in 24 hours, sometimes more frequently. A baby will cluster feed in the, most likely in the evening, that's it's usually a certain time of the day where a babe has a few hours of one feed going into the next, into the next, into the next. And that baby needs to do that, that's very normal. So lots of feeding. So really for the first few months, a baby needs to feed on demand. So as in whenever the baby needs to. Routines don't work with uh, breastfed babes. It goes completely against the physiology of how breastfeeding works um, in the baby's body. And the very best way to have a, a settled baby and a, a, happy, a happier family is to read your baby's feeding cues. So you need to read your baby's early feeding cues to get a best feed. And these are as your baby is just about waking up, starting to stir a bit, starting to sort of make little movements. That is your early feeding cues. The middle feeding cues are when a baby is starting to root around and, and look for the breast and might be bringing the hands up to the mouth and the, the head area. The late feeding cues are when a baby is crying um, and, and that when a baby has got to that stage of crying, often a baby is far too hungry to actually get a good latch. It's a little bit like if you've been really, really upset uh, and then you're expected to eat a three course meal, you can't because the adrenaline's up there and you just can't do it. So that baby needs to be calmed down first. If you find your baby is has got to that stage where the baby is too hungry and cannot feed, then you need to calm that baby down either by um, trying to feed your baby in the bath, which um, I mentioned yesterday, which can be very helpful, um, or using some white noise or rocking, singing, whatever calms your baby down, plenty of skin to skin can be helpful and then try to latch your baby. So the frequency of how often a baby needs to be fed, basically, it's whenever that baby wants it, so long as it's at least six to eight times in 24 hours. And 
ideally you shouldn't go more than about four or five hours between feeds and that's so that your breasts don't become too engorged as well because then it's much more difficult for a baby to latch on. Uh, and a baby will often get too hungry as well if you leave it too long. So little and often is often really, really good. Um, so I hope that helps about how frequently a, ba a, a baby should be feeding. If you've got any questions and want to ask any more of them, please feel free to either message below or you can message me uh, separately. And like I said yesterday, I'm very happy to um, do face to FaceTime con uh, consultations if needed as well. So do please contact me. Okay, thank you for listening and watching and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye for now.